guys. Happy Thursday. I just wanted to read you a book about um, butterflies since we're working on butterflies and I've been showing you on Zoom the life cycle of the butterfly. I'm going to read a little book today about um, butterflies. The Amazing Life Cycle of Butterflies is the title and it's written by Kay Barnham and illustrated by Maddie Frost. Illustrated means that's who drew the pictures. Okay. <clears throat> in the warmer months of spring and summer, butterflies flutter about the beautiful insects, carry pollen from flower to flower, just like the bees. But did you know that this is just one stage of a butterfly's incredible life cycle? A butterfly begins its life as a tiny egg. Some eggs are round, some are oval, and some are have ridges. The female butterfly sticks her eggs onto a leaf or a stem very close together. This plant will soon become food. Inside butterfly eggs, new life is growing. But these creatures are not yet butterflies. After a few days, the eggs hatch and the butterfly larvae appear. Butterfly larvae are also known as pupa or caterpillars. At first, they look small and wriggly like worms. Oh, Colonel wants to go outside. He's whining over here. A caterpillar's job is to eat. Most caterpillars eat plants and some others eat insects. They eat so much that soon their skin becomes too tight and it splits and underneath is a new, bigger skin. As the caterpillar grows, this happens again and again. See, he got rid of his old skin. It's called molting. Caterpillars have many enemies and they are gobbled up by birds, wasps, and ladybugs. In some countries, human eats, humans eat them too. Caterpillars use bristles and spikes and smells and poison to frighten away their enemies. And sometimes they disguise themselves with eye spots or patterns. This caterpillar is pretending to be a snake. See him down there on the bottom? He kind of does look like a snake. But look what he's eating. What's he having for lunch? A leaf. When the caterpillar has finished growing, it hangs upside down from a leaf or a branch and barely slowly a shell forms around it. And this shell is called a chrysalis. See, he's hanging upside down and then he starts making his chrysalis. Like the caterpillar, the chrysalis is patterned. This makes it difficult for the enemies to spot. That's a fancy word called camouflaging. Inside the chrysalis, something amazing is happening. The, chrysalis, the caterpillar dissolves into a soupy mixture and then eyes and legs and wings and antennas and other body parts begin to form. Ooh fancy. And after a week or two, the caterpillar will have changed into a brand new butterfly. Can you find the cocoon? See if you can find the chrysalis on that tree. Yep, yep, right above the dog. Oh, here comes the good part. At last, the adult butterfly pushes his way out of the chrysalis and this splits open and the butterfly appears. Here he comes out of his chrysalis. It's a tight fit because the because inside the chrysalis, so the butterfly must first unfold his soft wings, which will take a few hours to harden. And then it flies for the very first time. Oh, Colonel, we don't want you to read with us. Go away. A butterfly has four wings. These are covered with millions of tiny colored scales, which create different patterns. Look at all those different kinds of butterflies. Wow. Some wing patterns allow butterflies to hide and others have special markings that look like big eyes to scare away their enemies. Bold, bright colors attract mates. Look at all those different kinds of butterflies. A butterfly tastes with its feet and smells with its antennas. Its mouth is shaped like a long tube. The butterfly uses this to feed on nectar from the flowers. It's kind of like a straw for a butterfly. Butterflies can only fly if they are warm. When they are too cold, 
they bask in the sun until their temperatures rise. Bask means to like sunbathe until their temperature goes up and then they can move around again. Some species of butterflies, like the monarch, live for a few months, but most live for just one or two weeks. Man. During their short lives, butterflies mate, and then the female butterfly lays more eggs, and the life cycle starts again, all over again. See, what did she leave right here on the piece of leaf? She left some eggs. Do you know that butterflies are in danger? Pesticides cause, pesticides cause them harm. And there are fewer butterflies areas for them to visit. Soon, many species may come extinct. That's sad. Extinct means we won't have any anymore. You can help by planting flowers such as bedelias, verbenias, and lavender in sunny sheltered spots and then wait for butterflies to appear. There's the cycle. See, they start as egg, then they go to be a caterpillar, then they make the chrysalis, and then they go to a butterfly and the butterfly lays more eggs and it goes round and round and round. That's why they call it a cycle. A butterfly's life cycle has four different stages. These are the eggs, the caterpillar, the chrysalis, and the adult butterfly. During the life of the butterfly transformation, it transforms completely. This amazing process is called metamorphosis. Can you say that word? Metamorphosis. It's a fancy word. It means changing. The end. Hope you liked my butterfly book. Bye, guys.